No, you're not, Goldilocks. You and I need to have a little chat. Okay, I don't like the way you're treating these children. You don't listen to them, you don't understand them, and you're always judging them. Now, they live in a different world than you do. A world you left behind a long time ago, but you know what? They're not gonna be there for very long. So why don't you just let them have it now? That's very nice, but I don't think that speech will go down very well where you're going. I'm trying to think I could to stop. Come on, Dr. Lewis, let's go. Uh, Who are these people? It doesn't make any difference. Bye-bye, Bobby. No, you're not leaving. You're coming back. No, I won't. Come on, please, we're gonna hit traffic. I love you. I just want to say good fun. Could never have said hello. Don't you understand Ow! what you've done? Not since the great molar scandal of 42 has something of this magnitude occurred. My goodness, the whole Tooth Fairy program is in jeopardy. You were strongly cautioned right from the start not to cavort with mortals. I was just trying to help you. Children. Yes, I think you were the first Tooth Fairy who thought he or she could save the world. It's not your place to get involved. Involved twice since I got involved. Huh? Yeah, you talk about getting involved. You have never got involved with anyone. Maybe I didn't get involved because I was frightened. Maybe I thought if I really loved somebody that they would go away like my... Never mind. I know better now. Do you? Yes, I do. Starts! Take her to the elevator! Music. Joe, Joe, listen, boys, you don't really want to do this. Bro, help me here. It's going to be okay, Captain. It's not going to be okay. This is not what things look like. They're going to be okay. They're taking you to the elevator. Hey, boys, you're going to party tonight, huh? Take that, Dr. Lewis. Rogers. Go to hell! Are you all right? Hey, miss, are you okay? Please let me into heaven, please. I was just trying to help the little kids, please. Catherine, relax. Everything is okay. Oh, this isn't hell, is it? No, it's Main Street. You, you've been in a little accident. Well, uh, was this all a dream? Catherine, everything is all right. Are you all right? No, 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 no. I'm fine, I'm fine. I, I have patience to see. I want to get up now. Is he with you? Your husband's not gonna like this. I 
can't believe you never told me about him. And you look so innocent. Catherine. Raul! You've been given a second chance. Make the most of it. Uh, Raul, wait, wait. Raul. On Saturday night, what are you doing? I thought maybe you could come by with Dan and have dinner with me. Who are you talking to? I'm talking to you. I make a great chicken marsala. Oh, oh, no, no, wait a minute. You're vegetarian, right? Right. Okay, then I'll make vegetarian lasagna. Oh, and you know what? Why don't you take the rest of the day off, huh? You deserve it. Thanks for the flowers. You have a patient. His name is Bobby Jameson. Catherine! You guys know each other? We're old friends. What are you doing here? I work here. How do you think I look without the crown? Very stunning. Bobby, I never got a chance to thank you. I wanted to thank you and your friends for all you've done for me. We didn't do anything. Yes, you did. Let's see what we got going on here. Ooh, ooh. This has to come out of here. I think it's your last baby tooth. Cool. You gave me a great gift, Bobby. Now I'm going to show you a little trick. Pull this on the count of three. One, two, three. Bobby, I'll never be able to repay you. For what? For how you help me. I'm talking about all the help you gave me. When you and your... your last baby tooth, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah. You don't remember me, do you? Remember you, uh, you're my new dentist. <laughs> That's right. I'm your new dentist. And a darn good one at that. I'm sorry I'm late. I was just parking the car. Is everything okay? Catherine. Hi. Hey, Dad, she pulled my tooth. Good. Good. Oh, and uh, you want to be sure and take that tooth with you because, you know, the tooth fairy gives big premiums for pulled teeth. Yeah, right. Like, I believe in the tooth fairy. You'd be surprised. Thanks a lot. Sure. like baseball? Yes. Sure. Okay, uh, would, you, would, would you like to go with me to a game Friday night? Oh, sure, we'd love to. Yeah. Good. Do you want to walk us to our car? I I'd love to. Good. Okay. Thank you. It seemed real clear to me that Dad had used his connections in limbo to pull a few strings. It's funny. No matter how hard you try, you can't close your heart forever. And the minute you open it up, you never know what's going to come in. But when it does, you just got to go for it. Because if you don't, and you got to trust me on this one, there's no point in being here.
Show.